Stellar sending Brolic over to the turnbuckle. Brolic missing with the springboard. And these two are really going at it here in this first match. In this two out of three falls contest. What a fierce kick. And there's the monkey flip. And if this goes three matches, you got to wonder how much damage it's going to take out of each one of these wrestlers. Stellar going up to the top rope. High risk. Connecting with two knees right to the chest. Stellar with a fireman's carry takedown. Lifting Lassiter. Brolic back up to his feet. The knee face buster. Lassiter. Missing with the running knee. He missed it. And that was a mistake by Jack Stellar right there. Missing with his finisher. Brolic able to capitalize. And here's some more trash talking. Lassiter. Stellar missing with the knee again. Brolic going to roll to the outside of the ring. That'll cause some damage. Now both men back in and Stellar hitting the chop block. Going back to work on the legs of Brolic. And it's well known that one of Stellar's main strategies is to take out the legs of people who like to run around that ring and fly all over the place like Brolic likes to do. What the fuck? Okay. Brolic with the knee to the back of the head. Stellar somehow pushing himself up off the mat. But Brolic is right there to knock him back down. Springboard into a crossbody. Nicely done. And Brolic is picking up steam here. Sit down power bomb. Brolic is feeling it. Spine buster by Brolic that time. Going for the shining wizard. And he got all of it. Going for the pin in the wind. And Stellar kicked out before the referee even counted to one. How the hell did Jack Stellar manage to kick out of that finisher by Brolic so fast? Brolic can't believe it now. Hitting the spinning neck breaker on Stellar. Looking like he doesn't know what he has to do to put this guy away. But he's damn sure trying. Hitting his signature stomps on Stellar. Brolic lifts him up, hits him with a cutter. Another finisher by Brolic, going for the pin again. And Stellar kicks out again before the referee could even put his hand down one time. Where is Stellar getting this from? How is he managing to stay alive in this match? Now Stellar with the knee face buster out of nowhere. And Jack Stellar is right back in the thick of things in this match. Amazingly, kicking out of those finishers by Brolic. Both of these guys have been in the ring for a while now and taking quite a bit of damage. The ever resilient former three-time UWF World Heavyweight Champion Jack Stellar. Right now his head must be screaming in agony. Brolic back on the Good offense. Has the arm. Lassiter gets shut down. Backhand on Stellar. Floors him. Oh my, just raw Stellar back up with a big right hand of his own. And there are those back to work on the leg of Brolic. What a deadly submission hold this is. We might see a tap out right Now here. a submission move by Stellar. Brolic fights out of it. Right to the head. Oh man. Both of these guys just brawling right now. 
sick DDT by Brolic. Stellar still in there throwing fisticuffs. Brolic blocking that shot by Stellar. Able to land, land a drop salt. Stellar right back with lefts and rights. Sending Brolic out over the top rope all the way down to the floor on the outside of the ring. And this is UWF Danger Ahead, the Universal Wrestling Federation, the best in SmackDown versus Raw online wrestling. You're only going to see this kind of action at a UWF event. Two legends of the game right now doing battle, settling a bitter rivalry, trying to see who the better man is. Two out of three falls. We're still in the first match. Both guys on the outside of the ring. Looks like Brolic just hit a German suplex on Stellar. Right now his head must be screaming in agony. Two. Watch it. Running knee lift by Brolic. Right in the kisser. Combination of kicks right there. Stellar got a reversal in. But then Brolic came back with an insiguri. STO by Brolic. Lasseter was just a bit faster on that exchange. Stellar going high risk again. Connecting with the knees. Right now his head must be screaming in agony. Smart move there by Jack Stellar, realizing Brolic was stunned. Stellar is all in right now. Once he gets going, he is very hard to stop. Brolic got a reversal in, but as you can see, the work that Stellar has been doing on his legs is starting to pay off. Stellar going back to the figure four again. Brolic getting a rope break. But the damage was done. Now Stellar hitting the knee lift out of nowhere. This could be it. Going for the pin. And he got him. Jack Stellar wins the first fall in this two out of three falls match. And now, both guys already after the match going at it again as the cage is being lowered. We're getting ready for the second match in this two out of three falls contest. Steel cage match time. Brolic versus Stellar. Brave gladiators must now do battle within the trap. And here we go. Cage. Already, Brolic coming at Stellar. The steel cage has been lowered. The second match has began. Stellar got the first match, or the first fall, I should say. Able to hit that knee lift on Brolic and get the pin. And now, Brolic has to win. Otherwise, this match is over with. Beautiful Hurricane Rana by Brolic. Now a clothesline. Jack Steller has seen that move tonight already. Brolic not wasting any time. Missing with the spinning wheel kick though. Now catches Steller from behind. Pulls him down to the mat. And Brolic going for his signature stomps. What an impressive combination of moves. He's looking to put his opponent away right here. And you could just see how bad Brolic wants to beat Stellar, hitting him with a cutter. What a fierce kick. 
only yeah. way you can win this match is to climb out of the cage after hitting the finisher on your opponent. Ooh. Stellar with a chop block. Oh, wow. Watch out here. Oh, it doesn't get more punishing than that. Now a backhand by Brolic after that reversal. Stellar able to get a reversal in as Brolic was trying to lift him up off the mat. Once again, no holds barred in this match. Everything is legal. Now Brolic going to send Stellar over into the turnbuckle. Follows him in with two knees to, to the chest. Now a knee to the back of the head. That was an absolutely incredible... Brolic going for that sick-looking neck breaker. Twisting Jack Stellar's body all around and then driving his face right into the mat. Oh, man. Stellar with a nice belly to back suplex. Going back to work on the lower body of Brolic. Jack Stellar knows what he has to do in order to beat Brolic. He's already gotten the first pinfall over him in the two out of three falls contest. I got a feeling, Michael, that somebody's going to get hurt and get hurt badly in this one. Russian leg sweep out of a Cobra clutch there by Brolic. Now just putting the knee right to Jack Stellar's mug. Brolic going springboard with the crossbody. Stellar with a reversal after that move by Brolic. Brolic really had his momentum going right there. But Jack Stellar putting a stop to it. Not a knee face buster. This has been a very physical, very intense, anything goes contest. The toll these competitors have taken. Stellar with a T-bone suplex. Flipping Brolic over onto the canvas. Shots to the collarbone right there. Jack Stellar working on all parts of the body. A swift kick. Like Ste Stellar was going for the fireman's carry takeover. Brolic got a reversal in. Able to answer back with a backbreaker. Now another knee to the back of the head. Drop salt by Brolic. So now a spine buster. Shining wizard by Brolic. And he's trying to climb out of the cage right now. Not wasting too much time. Brolic trying to get the second fall here. Stellar kipping up now. And he's going to bring Brolic back down into the cage. As Brolic was trying to climb out. Under the rules of a no disqualification match, the referee is powerless to stop this one. This Stellar feeling the sense of urgency. Going for his finisher. The knee. Oh no. Stellar choosing not to try to climb out of the cage. Going to inflict more damage on Brolic. Stellar going up top. The knees right to the chest. And Brolic has seen that move quite a few times already tonight here at Danger Ahead. More than he would have liked to. 